All right, let's bring in trial attorney Michael J. For Michael, I'll start with you. Uh, the defendant had the opportunity to speak. He took that opportunity. I want to know what you thought about his statement to the court. I thought that they were they were just fine. I mean, I think it's just in line with what we thought. Um, this young man's father hired these attorneys, sat with these attorneys, my assumption, did well with these attorneys and cried to these attorneys and said, I need you to save my son. I need you to guide me. He did something awful. I need you to guide me. And I think these attorneys sat down with this young man and said, your family's suffered. Everybody's suffering. You need to plead guilty. You need to be, you need to basically, they all knew they were going to be here, Mike. They all knew that they were going to have the sentencing. They all knew that the witnesses were going to have the victim impact statement. They all knew they were going to be here and they prepared him for it. He's prepared for it. I truly saw remorse in his voice. I saw remorse in his actions. Again, he tried to cut his own head off. He pled guilty to these crimes. I felt like I, he, he, him and his father convinced me that this is not a sentence that should be a million to two million years. I think that it should be less than that. I think he should walk free one day. Even the minimum here is 18 years, right? So I think, I think his behavior and his elocution, I, I, I was satisfied with it.